Hello, my name is Jan, and today we are going to talk about patterns inside DraftSite. First, let's zoom in on the area that we're going to work with. So in here, we have cars. Of course, if we want to fill in the parking lot with the additional cars, we can start copying one by one. But there is a better way. Let me show you how we can do it by using patterns. You can either type patterns or array and still recognize it. We can have circular, linear, or path. We're going to do linear and we're going to do an associative pattern, which is very important. We're going to have vertical two and four on horizontal. So we're going to copy that. We're going to change the distance here to 5.7. And if we satisfy, we're going to say, OK. So it went and made this. Now, well, this is wrong. This is not how I wanted it. That's OK. That's why associative is makes a big difference. So if I select this handle right here and move it down, notice that I just filled it in. But that's not it. Also, there is another handle and I can adjust the position automatically without doing anything. So this is how easy to use patterns. And patterns can be, as I said, linear, circular, or can, they can follow the path. A very quick and easy way to create additional entities in your drawing without using copy command, which saves you a lot of time. 